what's going on everybody? Thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Surfing with Sam. And this week we're going to be talking about three really cool sites and the theme is video tricks. So you're not going to want to miss this one. And of course, as always, we are going to bring you our pick for viewer site of the week. So don't touch that mouse. Okay, so our theme is video tricks, and the first site I'm going to tell you about is ytdub.com, and this is a site where you can dub YouTube videos with other YouTube videos. It's really fun, actually. All right, so let's take a look. Right now, we're on the homepage, and the first thing you have to do is name your mix, and we named our mix Surfing with Sam. Then you have to take the YouTube ID of the video you want to use, and we are going to use this tech update episode 54. Now if you go to URL and you copy it, go back to YTDub and you paste, you just want the YouTube ID and you can find that after the equal sign. So erase everything before. Now you want to do the same for the YouTube video that you just want the music. And we found this uh, this random music, Curd Maverick Blue Monday Electronic, um, it's a vandalism mix, I, I don't know, I only heard it once, but happened to find it under the indie band section, and I liked it. So you do the same, just copy the URL, go back to your site, the YT Dub site, paste, and delete everything, including the equal sign, there you go, and that is the YouTube ID. Now, it's important to note that if the YouTube video you want, if the embed code is disabled, you can't use it, okay? So before you get going with, you know, wanting to dub really popular songs and music videos and things like that, you have to make sure that the embed code is not disabled. Okay, so then you can set the volume. The original video volume, you want zero, so all we're going to hear is the dubbed volume. Is this a public video? You can click yes or no. And then you pick your theme. If you're looking for, you know, something funny, sad, action, uh, translation, or horror, and we're going to go with horror, just because I've, I've done funny before, and now I want to try horror. And then you just click on the button that says Dubbo, and you click, okay, scroll down, and we got music. Oh, yeah, and this is not computer TV music. Oh yeah, okay. Now only if Albert and Bauer were dancing. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. We gotta get back to the show. But how cool is that, right? And up top, how do we stop this? Uh, I'm not sure how to stop it actually. All right, but it gives you the link up top. Let's get out of here. You get the point, right? Okay. Woo! Okay, ytdub.com. Check that one out if you are uh, bored one day and you feel like messing around with some YouTube videos. Okay, next site of the day is anymoto.com, and this is where you can upload photos and make a really cool video slideshow. If you go into create video, it's really easy. Uh, you can click uh, a short video, which is going to be about 12 to 15 images. And I think for the full length video, actually, you have to create a paid account. So stick with the short video. Um, you can upload the images from your computer. You can retrieve them from another site. Or you can select pictures already on Animoto. So uh, let's do from retrieve from another site. And look, here are your choices. Flickr, Facebook, Smug Mug, Picasa, or Photo Bucket. So if you have any of those accounts, you can upload directly from your albums. All right, I have a Facebook account. I'm going to upload from my Facebook account. Continue. Let's see here. OK, and it takes me to the Facebook link, and I have to do my password. Don't look now. OK, password's in. Log in. So here you go. I can pick from my wall photos. I already did the Wheel of Fortune slideshow. So let's, um, let's use my wall photos. So you just click on Retrieve. And it takes a couple minutes to download. Not too long, though. So I have my images. And remember, it can't be any more than 15 to make a short video, which is 30 seconds long. 
And once your images are retrieved, you can either add more, you can add text, uh, you can rotate, you have a couple different options here. All right, we have one more image. Okay, all images have been retrieved. And you click continue. It's telling me I've only created six images. So this video is going to be kind of short, but that's okay. This is just to show you how it's done. All right, and the next step is to upload your music. Now they have quite a cool selection, Animoto does actually, that you can choose from or you can upload from your computer. We're going to select from their collection. And you have a bunch of different genres to choose from. Top 40, indie rock, electronica, hip hop. You can see them all right here actually. Um, and you can even go to oldies. And uh, all right, let's pick one. Let's just pick Dixie Swing. And you can play it first. Okay, and then I like that one, so we're going to select it. It's going to save. All right. And save and continue. Almost there, guys, almost there. Again, we're creating a short, and then you can pick your speed. Let's make it a slow one. Oh, it's only available full-length videos. Okay, so you can only pick your speed with the 30-second videos. That's good to know. All right, so continue. I'm going to give it a title, Sam's Wall. Lots of photos. Just add in your description here. And producer name. There you go. Create video. Now, the longer your video, the more the pictures, it's going to take a little bit of time. The good news is, is that you don't have to stay on this site. You can X out of it. And they have your email address when you sign up for an account. And they'll send you an email when your video is done. OK? Oh, so here we are. And it looks like it's ready. Shall I do the honors? Oh, look at that. A 30 second video slideshow. And now you can share with all your friends. And if you go down below, you'll see um, if you want to remix this video, change the music up, add more photos, you can do that. You can also send your video to friends. You can post and embed the code online, you know, let's say uh, on your MySpace page. You can download this video, you can export it directly to YouTube. You can upgrade it and uh, make it DVD quality, or you can even tweet right from Animoto. So check this out, Animoto.com. I'm going to tell you about our next site, and it's twitvid.io. And it's a way to send videos to all your Twitter followers. It's really cool. So right now we're on the home page, and I just started uploading a video that I shot on my Kodak ZX1. So it's uploading right now. Now, you can upload to uh, the site from a file saved on your computer. You can also email a video from your mobile phone, and it gives you the email right here, you at twitvid.io. Or you can record straight from your webcam to all your followers. We were having some problems getting the webcam working earlier, but uh, when you check out this site, the webcam may be ready. So um, the video is going to process, and once it's done processing, it's going to tweet out to all the computer TV followers, and uh, you'll get to see this video. It's pretty cool, actually. And if you scroll down, you'll see some other people that are using um, this site, TwitVid, and you'll see the videos that they uploaded. So it's a great site to check out, twitvid, twitvid.io. Okay? Now, our last site of the day is Omegle, and this is our viewer's pick. Now, I was trying out Omegle earlier, and I'm not going to lie, it kind of weirded me out. Basically, it's a chat room with one person, you and one other person, completely random, and this person is going to be a stranger. They could be from all over the world. In fact, a couple days ago, I was talking to somebody from Alaska, okay? I'm telling you, it's a little weird. You should try it out. Omegle, O-M-E-G-L-E dot -E com, and let's, let's go into a chat. So you just click on Start a Chat going to connect someone to connecting to a server and it's going to oh oh a stranger is typing hold on somebody's typing to me i have no idea where this person 
is from, hmm, what is this person going to say? I'm going to say, hi. Oh, he said hi. The stranger said hi. Where are you from? So I guess it's a good way to meet people. I'm not really sure. Oh, Brazil. Miami here. So kind of cool, right? Talking to a complete stranger from Brazil, omegle.com. And check this one out, okay? Talk to strangers. Like I said, it's a little weird. I don't know. Maybe you'll like it. But thanks so much for uh, sending this one to us. Again, it's our, our video tricks, some really cool sites that I'm sure you're going to find useful. Now, if you have a site, don't forget to send me an email, sam at com.pewter.tv. Let us know what's out there that we need to know about and feature. All right. Our stranger has disconnected, and it's time for us to peace out. So see you next time.